Hello, Mr. Gasta here. Welcome to Gastonia Production Studios. Uh, this is Homework 44. This is to help you with uh, Homework 44. People often have trouble with this. So, here we go. Important to read the directions. Check this out. Um, dealing with the compass direction for latitude and longitude. Get in the correct compass direction. Uh, correct, that's a typo. Get in the correct compass direction for latitude and longitude is often the hardest part. For each point, write the compass direction only, which is going to be north, south, east, or west. Do not write the numbers. This is to focus solely on the compass direction. So, for instance, um, hence, latitude is going to be listed as north or south of the equator, after the number, of course, which we're not doing on this one. Uh, longitude, the direction will be either east or west, and you compare that to the prime meridian with a zero longitude. So, some things to help are as follows. Um, so here's a picture of the globe here. This direction is north, south, east, and west. So I put that on there. And there are some examples right here. Some examples right here. So always use all of this before you um, dive in. Okay. So I'm just going to do this. So latitude of point A. Where's point A? Point A is right there. So the latitude line for point A would be a line that looks like this. Okay. If I was to draw on the latitude line, it's that. That's something you need to know. Now, what would the compass direction be? I'm comparing it to the equator. Here's the equator right here. The equator's right there. So, this line is what direction from the equator? It is north, therefore, latitude of point A would be north. Okay? Longitude of point A. Longitude line would be a line that runs like this. So now I have a line that's kind of going this way. I compare it to zero. Um, I compare it to zero. The longitude, the prime meridian, which is right here. F what direction is this line from zero? It is west of it. Therefore, uh, whatever your number would be here, the compass direction after it would be west. Longitude of point B. B is right here. The longitude line goes right here. I'm comparing it to zero longitude, which is right here. Therefore, what direction is, is this longitude line here from zero? It is east of it. Therefore, after my number, I would be writing east. A latitude of point B. So point B is right here. The latitude line would be something would, would kind of go this general direction here, like this. Where is this compared to zero, which is the equator right here? This line. So it is what direction from it? South. Therefore, the answer to four, it would be south. A latitude of point E. E is right here. I'm doing I'm doing latitude, so it's going to be this, this line. Compare that to the equator, which is down here. From the equator, you would have to go. It is uh, north of the equator. Therefore, that is number five is north. Latitude of point G. Latitude. Now I got to remember. Okay, it's this. It's this line right here. It's actually labeled thirty. Okay. So that I compare that to the equator. The equator is right here. And it is what direction from the equator? It is south of the equator. South. Longitude of point H. Longitude. So that would be a line that goes this way. I'm comparing that to zero, which is right here. It is what direction from there? I can use my compass rose here. It is east. Therefore, it will be east. Longitude of point C. Point C is right here. Um, I'm comparing this line to zero, which is here. What direction is this line from zero? It is west, therefore, its compass direction for that longitude will be west. Longitude of point F. That's a, that's a line that runs like this. I compare that to zero. F would be to the east of zero, therefore, east. Latitude of point H. And where's H? H is here, latitude. It's right on this 20 line. I compare that to the equator, which is here. It would be south of the equator, therefore, south. Okay, I hope that made some sense. Let's go on to the back. Okay, again, uh, use these examples. Use the examples for each point. Write the compass direction only, north, south, east, or west. Do not write the numbers. We're trying to really get this uh, in our head because that is the part that uh, so many students get confused on. So let's do this. Latitude of Moscow. Latitude of, let me just fix that. Latitude of Moscow. 
Moscow's here. This is the latitude. I compare that to the equator, which is here. It's north, north of the equator. Longitude of Hong Kong. Okay, uh, that's this line here. I'm comparing that to zero. This is the prime meridian here. Therefore, it is east of the prime meridian. Latitude of Rio de Janeiro. That, this is the latitude line right here. Right, right here. I'm comparing that to zero, which is here, so therefore it is south. It is south of that. The latitude of Rome. Uh, I'm doing latitude, so that's uh, that's this flat line here. Okay, this is the equator. It is north of the equator. North. Longitude of Lima, and Lima is right here. That's this up and down line. I'm comparing this line to the prime meridian, which is right here. It is west of the prime meridian. So longitude of Lima is west. Longitude of Bombay. Bombay is this dot right here. I'm doing longitude. Is that, that's this line up and down. Here's the prime meridian. Therefore it is east of the prime meridian. East. Washington DC. Latitude. Washington DC is right here. Equator's down here. Washington DC is north of the equator. Latitude of Melbourne. Melbourne's here, compared to the equator, which is here. This is south of the equator. Latitude of Melbourne would be south. Longitude of Mexico City. Longitude. Longitude, longitude is here. I'm comparing it to the prime meridian. What direction is it from the prime meridian? It is west of it. West. Latitude of Lagos. Uh, it's this dot right here. I'm doing latitude, so I gotta really look right there, and then the equator's right here. So it is a little bit north of the equator. North of the equator. Longitude of Calcutta. Longitude is right here, compared to the prime meridian, which is here, and that is east. East. Latitude of Calcutta. I think you get the idea. So here, to check your answers, north, north. West, the equator, a squiggly line. Okay. And trace over the prime meridian with a solid line. That's the last two questions. Okay, I hope this helped. You really need to get this in your head. Um, go through this video again. But uh, this is a key important part to latitude and longitude. Make sure that you know it because you're really going to need to know it.